My name is Heeman Farai. Here's a great way to free up some space in your Macintosh. If this video helps you, please subscribe and share. Thank you so much. Well, here we go. First, right click in your hard drive to get info. Once you get info, there's going to be a tab that's going to open up and this tab is going to tell you a lot about your computer. Right now, I have 17.45 gigabyte purgeable. What does that mean? It means I could get rid of that space. My capacity is 2 terabyte and I've only used 658 gigabyte. So I need to find out where, what's taking away the majority of my space. So the next step after that is to use a software to clean your computer. But in this case, I'm going directly onto the Apple icon on the left side and I click on the Apple icon about this Mac. That's going to open a, a new pop-up and here you could go and check your display. You could check your color uh, setting. I am going to check my, I don't have services support, but I check my memory because at one time one slot wasn't working. Now let's go to the storage. Once you click the storage, it's going to pop up this little display box and there it's going to calculate and it's going to tell you what's taking away a lot of your space. If you put your mouse over it, it'll show you that different options are what's causing this problem. Then you click on manage. Once you click on manage, it is going to open a new pop-up. And in here under recommendations, you could go and make some changes. I am taking all those things from iCloud because I want my computer to work fast. So I'm unchecking the documents and photo to move back and forth from my cloud to my Macintosh. You could go in here and make changes and see what's taking away some space. Of course, you do see that I only have 658. Then if you want to optimize storage, you could click on the iTunes and that's going to optimize storage. You want to empty your trash or set it to empty after 30 days, you could do that. But review files is what I like. When I click review files, aha, uh -huh, this is what I see. Under review files, there are so many files and you could actually tell which one is taking away space. If you click on the size, it'll sort the size from highest to the lowest size. Now, you could go in there and you can look at it. I'm looking at my files and I see that I have a lot of movies. I could click on this movie and I could open it and view it, see if it's something that I want or if I want to delete. So please don't delete it unless you take a look at it. First, take a look, make sure it's a file that you want to delete. If it's an old file, you could delete. If not, you could keep it there. In this case, I'm keeping mine. Now. You could go there on the iBooks, you could check if you have files there that you're not using. You can go on the iCloud Drive. Well, I don't have it checked, so it's not going to work in your iOS files, iTunes. You could go there individually on the mail, and the messages, photos, and I've turned mine off, so it's not going to show up here. Photos, you want to go there, you could turn on photos in iCloud, but I, I'm, I'm turned off, so you're not going to see anything. Of course, the trash. Now, once you do that, delete which files you want and you should be perfectly well. Please remember to subscribe and like this video. Hopefully it helps you. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Talk to you soon.